I do need to listen to my body a bit more. The tink is great for that. It will test my blood oxygen levels, my beats per minute, and my breaths per minute. In doing that, it'll also tell me how stressed my body is at that time. Kobe Kina Blue is the, the highest peak in Southeast Asia. It's something which, since I've lived in Asia, I've always wanted to do. I'm the only one gullible enough to say yes to this. So uh, we're going to climb Kina Blue together. Uh, the space of it looks pretty steep and really rocky. Yeah. I took my tink rating today. My scores are pretty good. My scoring this morning wasn't brilliant on tink. I'm nervous about how my body feels, but um, we need to get hiking and get up there and just see how the body reacts. It's a bit cold outside, it's a bit windy right now, but got all the gear that I need. So yeah, ready to hit the mountain, man. I am 4K up uh, the side of Mount Kinabalu right now, and it is cold. <laughs> I was just did my ting reading. Chris is doing really well. His body is functioning the way it should do. Mine's dropped off to Vita reading of in the 50s and a Zen reading in the 30s. The training is definitely paying off, but as of right now, my hands are freezing. The Vita reading told me I had 90% oxygen in my blood. 10% less than what you would want to function at normally. That's clearly the altitude having an effect on me. And it's only going to get harder as we go up higher. Wow. I am 3,200 meters above sea level. That was a very challenging, challenging hike. I'm still quite jovial. James is a bit, uh, James is a bit grumpy. So after that fun day of climbing, it's not over. There's more. Awesome. And it's at two in the morning. The wind is really kicking up. I'm really happy we went shopping for all the gear that we had because if we hadn't done that, I would be a human popsicle right now. My beta is down to the high high 30s, so that's dropped off considerably since lunchtime. The heart rate kind of kept up, and that, that's fine, but I have to force myself to, to, to breathe, and, and it, it was tough. So yeah, we'll see you tomorrow, heading to bed. See you guys later, it's end of the night. It's been very rough. It's like a hangover. It's the whole of this part of the brain is just throbbing and it feels like someone's got it in a vice. I slept maybe four of the six hours last night. It was cold, really cold. I sat there in bed for two hours sleep thinking, will I make it or not? I will have to see. All I could think about was another four hours and actually increase the altitude. So I was like, In the yeah. dark. I'm excited to see the summit. I really want to see sunrise, so I'm going to do this. I'm a bit concerned when the guide calls the last quarter of what we're doing the danger zone. We climbed, the headache's getting worse, and then we start to lose balance. Sight is not really good. You have to be honest to yourself, and then you have to turn back.
What an adventure, absolute amazing adventure. This is the absolute highest I can possibly be in Southeast Asia. It was challenging, like, I haven't done something like that, and I don't think ever. This was tough, this was really tough. Am I built for it? Maybe now, a month ago, before we actually started using the tank and doing our training, no. All of this played a role in helping me get ready for this climb. It was a mixture of adrenaline with fear, with excitement, with every, every emotion. When I think personally, I can't do it. I was a little bit apprehensive about doing this before, but I've kind of proven now that I can do something like this. And now I'm going to go down. <laughs> we had to come all the way back down, and it was a crazy hike. No stopping straight to the bottom. But the best part is just walking through the gate at the very end, you know, like finishing this trip, finishing this trek, knowing that we've done this amazing thing that's behind us. <laughs> We can get a little bit of rest. Oh, no. Or no. <laughs> rest and relaxation. For there me, it's going to be sleeping. Yeah. A lot. Maybe a beer. Definitely a beer. Yeah, okay. I'll Some food and a beer. I'm sleeping. All right. Steak, All right, let's do this. Beer and ice cream.